This is a Love Life Horoscope Tarot Reading for Virgo. From February 23rd to March 9th, 2022. Let's get to it. What do we got going on for you and your love interest at the beginning of this time period? The Magician. I like it. The Queen of Pentacles. And the High Priestess. Wow, you are very close to this connection. It's, it's like you already know that this is coming in. This is, there's an invitation here that's coming to you. Something you may have waited a long time for with this person. It's like this, this, this knowing that this, such a spiritual connection. The magician with the high priestess. You may know each other from lifetimes with the eternity symbol. This is someone that has the skills, someone that knows how to, to manifest. Someone that, that is your divine counterpart here. Let's clarify. Let's clarify the, the Queen of Pentacles. What is this? For them? Equilibrium. Yeah, this is someone that balances you. For you? Materialism. Ah, so this connection is coming down from the 5D into the physical. You're about to receive some sort of invitation, something that you've waited so long for. I like this. I want to know more about this, this magician, this... Huh. Just... What crossed my mind was like a tarot reader, someone that uses a table. Let's just clarify this magician, yeah. What is this about? Page of Pentacles. The star, soulmate indicator. And the six of swords. Yeah, this is someone that has direct knowledge of you. They they already know you're their soulmate. This is someone that's manifesting you, but into reality that they're going to be sending you an invitation. It's influencing you in a way. It's it's making you move. It's, it's kind of like, let's clarify the Six of Swords. Like... Hold on a sec. Like, I'm, I'm getting something a little bit different here. Wait, let's just clarify the six of swords. For them? Progress. For you? Duties. Yeah, they're, they're, they're going to get you to do something. That This may be an invitation to travel. They're sending you an invitation here. You're going somewhere that you may have never been before, somewhere you thought about going. If you have the, the, this, this intuition, you would have thought of going to this destination before. And now you have, and now you're making progress on that. You may be dealing with an earth sign towards Virgo Capricorn or an Aquarius. You're going to see something from them. It's kind of like they're, they're making themselves very vulnerable here. They're, 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 they're unveiling themselves in a sense. It's really interesting. I feel this person is younger, you know, 20 to 30 years old. Someone very sensual.
But the Vine counterpart, right from the get-go, so many. What is this progress, the Six of Swords? Let's get, get into this a little bit more. What is this progress about? King of Pentacles. Ah. The Ten of Swords. And the Seven of Cups. There's going to be a burst of opportunity. Brand new potential here for you. Six of Swords. Yeah, it's it's something that comes out of nowhere. It's kind of like this person offers you the better things in life. It's like they're 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 impressing on you, like the King of Pentacles to the Queen of Pentacles. That that's another divine couple. Like they know exactly how to impress you with the finer things in life. This is someone very skillful. Some someone that's very good at manifesting. So it's like they have, it's put them in a position of being like, it's kind of like as above, so below, like they're able to manifest in things into being. So they, they have financial security. You won't know, th this may not be a trip. I'm not seeing any more travel indicators. What I'm seeing is, is they're influencing you to do something you've never done before, something that you you never imagined doing. And they, they it's like they know that this the way to impress you is to to get you to, to, to show you something that you've never imagined before. Something very real. Something you've never seen. Let's clarify. Let's clarify this King of Pentacles. For them, maturity. For you, integrity. Yeah, this person has this ability. Like they're mature beyond their years. Like I, I feel they're young. You're, they're young, but because they're they're such a good magician that that they just. It, it's like they offer you things that 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 are beyond them, you know? It's kind of like, it shows how much integrity integrity they have to be able to, to do something that, that is, is beyond their years. Hmm. I wanna know like what, what, are, what they're offering you though. Like that's what I really wanna know here. Let's just clarify, what are they offering? Can we get a read on that? Is it something that you, it's gonna be hard to put into words if you if you can't imagine this yet. I wanna ask it anyway. What are they offering? The Knight of Cups, mature love offer. The Empress. And the Queen of Cups. Yeah, they're younger than you, but they're, they just, they, they, it's, it's going to come across as so natural. Like it just, it's going to just make sense. Like it's, it's going to hit you in the heart in this, in this, in such a sentimental way that you're going to want to make an emotional investment. They know what to say. They, they know what to bring out. And it's not pushy. It's not. It's not showing off to you. It's just. It's kind of like they're they're gonna show you that you're on a pedestal. That, that going with. It's like something you may have wanted to do without ever knowing that you wanted to do it. So it's like this person shows you that they've known you from another life. That's the maturity. That's the integrity. Something that they say or offer you comes with, with such knowing of who you are, of how you want to be loved, that it, it, that there's no, there's no way to deny it. it you just go with the flow. I want to clarify this empress for them. Experience. It's like they've known you from before. 
they may be redoing something they've done in the past life. And it just, it feels like you just, you know, this person for you helpfulness. Yeah. They know how to give you the right cup of love. Something you've never gotten from anybody else. Something that you've, you never thought anyone, anyone would know about you. They just know. I really like this. In the extended, we'll look into, we'll go to the random love generated questions. I don't even look at them beforehand, but the way they come up is unreal. Like, check this out. What happened that made the love interest act the way they did towards you? So we're going to find out, like, is there more of a past life thing? We'll ask, what should your next move be? <laughs> what is a message for your highest good? And we'll ask, what are they planning for the future with you? Ooh, maybe that's how we get some information. What are they planning for the future with you? Good question. The link for the extended is down below. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you the best with your choices. Much love.